making the fried egg pizza. And I used a bag of Kraft mozzarella cheese, eight ounces. And I just stuck the whole bag in this microwavable bowl. And I used a cup of this almond flour. But if you don't like almond flour, you can also use coconut flour, which is also very low in carbs. Let me see this one. Here's the information on this one. Five total carbs minus one dietary fiber, so four. And coconut flour has mm, eight minus five, so three. But it might smell or taste like coconut. And then I just used a big spoonful, a tablespoon, of the Philadelphia cream cheese. Ah, which is falling out of my hand right now. And it has less than one carb. They all have like less than one carb. I haven't seen any of to zero. But you might. So then I stuck it on this microwavable bowl, put it in the microwave for 45 seconds, added one raw beaten egg, mixed it up again, put it in the microwavable bowl, put it in for another 45 seconds, and it looks like this. It looks like, like real pizza dough. Now, this is parchment paper. It's like by Reynolds Wrap parchment paper. And just roll it to the rolling pin. If you don't have a rolling pin, I don't know, probably like a heavy paper towel or something that you can roll it with. Let me see if I can find my rolling pin. There I have one. Pamper chef. You're gonna roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. I make mine really long and thin, and then I just stick it in a thin long pan. And then you'll bake it at 425. In a minute. But you'll just take off this top layer. I'm gonna roll a little less than that actually. Because I like a thin crust anyways. And then um, I think you'll just put a bunch of like little four holes in it. And then take the whole parchment paper on your baking pan tray and bake it in the oven. It will not catch on fire or anything. It's kind of like a wax paper, but it's called parchment paper so you start baking. And then, if you want, you can take it out of the oven, put the original back on, flip it over, and bake the other side if you want it crispy. And then just add whatever toppings you want. If you want, like, some marinara, if you just want white pizza, add, like, olive oil and some garlic and some ricotta cheese and mozzarella. Some spices, Italian spices. Um, you can even put, like that ranch powder or garlic powder in the dough for more flavor. And then add like sausage, bacon bits, pepperoni, ah, basically whatever you want. I like black olives and banana peppers, mushrooms and pepperoni. So you can do a half and a half. Have fun with that.